Uh, for three months, uh, Americans watched in anger as oil gushed into the Gulf of Mexico, and families along the coast watched in horror as their lives and livelihoods uh, were changed forever. It's not hard to figure out who should be responsible for compensating those who have lost so much through no fault of their own. When a company is perfectly happy to make billions of dollars taking a risky activity in public waters, then it needs to be perfectly comfortable with paying for any and all economic damages if and when something goes horribly wrong. And the law needs to make this clear. The overwhelming majority of Americans understand this common sense idea of fairness. In fact, it seems that just about the only people who think that taxpayers and coastal families should pay for oil companies' spills are oil companies themselves and the Republicans who seem to fight for them uh, in the Congress. While Republicans, most of them, applaud the fact that the Supreme Court has said corporations are individuals when it comes to speech, when it comes to treating them the same way, when it comes to responsibility that each and every one of us has, if we cause a problem, they take a hike. Not only do they take a hike, they protect the oil companies. It is so outrageous. And so this is a very important time for us to show the American people whose side we're on. The minority bill, as you can see, doesn't even cover BP, doesn't even cover any current lease. This is the Big Oil Protection Act. That's what they're about. Let's face it. And this is going to be one of those moments. It's a choice between the Democratic bill that's been brought out by Senator Reid um, that has four very important steps to move us forward to address the oil spill, um, to help us move our economy to a new energy economy, um, that help protect our environment through the Land and Water Conservation Fund, and a Republican bill that basically has three parts. No, it's drill, baby, drill, ignore the spill, and kill the bill. There's been enough energy spent in the United States Senate trying to obstruct legislation around energy to power the whole eastern seaboard. This one is, this one even surprises me that they are willing to block any kind of real liability uh, for these, for the oil industry. I, 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 nothing much surprises me about Republicans doing the bidding of the most privileged, wealthiest, um, sometimes retrograde interest groups in this country, but this one really takes the cake. When Americans for three months have seen this oil gushing into the Gulf and that they're still willing at all costs to jettison job creation, to jettison American values, to jettison what they say they stand for, um, all because big oil is their principal benefactor. It, it's, it's just amazing. That's why this legislation is so important. And again, make the contrast. Make the contrast where we want to take the country and what they want to bring the country back to. That's why this legislation is so important.